Welcome back. This is Pokemon Friendship Red, part 22. Uh, it's really cool that we're doing uh, part 22 on the last day of me being the age of 22. So that's exciting that it all worked out this way. Um, I'm also using my phone for its intended purpose of keeping track the time for today, because much like Dan said in the last episode, um, I ran really long in the last one, and we'd been doing that a lot previously. So let's try to keep it 20 minutes, 20-ish minutes, and hopefully that works out. So today, I am going to take on Sell It On Gym. I know Dan wanted to eventually get a gym battle under his sleeve, but I have a specific plan for today. So maybe next time. Uh, we're also going to need his expertise in the Elite Four, so I think we're just going to have to counter losses on that and let him save for the harder battles. Today, I'm going to take on Sell Out on Jim, and then I'm going to head, what direction is that, east, back to Lavender Town, because um, we have a rival battle, which we should totally be able to do with our current levels. Um, we can catch a Pokemon in the Pokemon Tower, we can also get the Poke Flute from Mr. Fiji in the Pokemon Tower. So we have a lot we can do. Um, and depending on time, we'll see if there's more that we're allowed, that we're able to do. Right now, let's just take on Erica in her grass type gym, and that works out perfectly. So we get one move off, and it's not gonna hurt us at all. Way to go, Twin Needle. Cool, 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 cool. Ben on that. I'm gonna switch out because uh, Twin Needle has been disabled. I'm gonna mouth head. I like being able to look over at my phone now and actually seeing like this much time has passed. So I really like what Dan did with the choice band. I had never used one throughout the game. I don't know that I actually ever got a choice band or choice item. I guess I would have had to get a choice item. It sounds like something I've gotten. Uh, I think you get one of those from beating uh, the Winstraight family. Is that right? Winstraight and Ruby Sapphire and Emerald. They're above Mawile City. I think you get some kind of choice item there. Uh, but I never used it. I never. I don't think I actually valued the or understood the value of it. But now I do. Uh, let's go this one. I think it's beneficial for us to bite, battle all these trainers. It's just they're at a really good level right now for the rest of our team. Uh, even with a Raikou. So, uh, Twin Needle, how you gonna come through for me, man? Oh, but it's got Splash. That makes me happy. Then that's use Sacred Fire. But yeah, uh, this gym in particular is a really good level for us um, to be leveling up. Endor is at a pretty good, at a pretty solid level right now, as is. Uh, Rain Fauna is about the same. Uh, Mouthhead is slowly getting there. X Cloud is about the same. Din didn't do much at all with him in the last episode, but that's fine. I totally agree with where he's coming from. He's like borderline usable, I would say. So, I don't know. We'll, we'll kind of see how that works out for us. Oh, the other thing. I wanted to do. I was under the impression that after this gym, we could use Fly, but we actually could have used Fly after Tenant Surge. So I think we could go back to the uh, daycare man and check out our coughing because uh, he's been in there a while. I think we put him in. Oh, it would have been before Rock Tunnel, I think. And we've done a bit since Rock Tunnel. So he should be... I don't know. 
I think I said should last time, and it wasn't as much experience as I hoped, but there's only one way to find out. Morning sun. <sighs> yeah, okay. But yeah, I'm really happy with Endor and how Endor has been doing. I'm also happy that I see Star Wars in two days. That's exciting. That, I don't know, that's, that attack seemed to go on forever. I thought it was, like, glitching. But, yeah, I would be very happy if there's a Endor appearance in the new Star Wars. Glad I avoided Super Fang. I'm glad Golem's hurt by the burn. I'm also glad that Bounce finished him off. I will not change Pokemon. I will not change Pokemon. High jump kick. I'm glad that didn't hit. Because it did most of the work for me. Ha 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 ha. What a decent bit of experience from that. I'm quite pleased. I think we can do this lady without healing. We're definitely going to heal before Erica though. Not that I think we need it, but I think it would be beneficial to do so. Let's go with some Twin Needle. I found Twin Needle's really hit or miss. It either, either like, swipes him out or doesn't do much at all. Okay, I was really worried about Air Blast there. I feel like that had been a move that was fatal for us in the past, so I apologize for just stopping. I was kind of freaking out internally. All right, so now let's go. Oh, I didn't even see her. Snuck out. Okay, so we'll do one more before we go ahead and heal. Nurse Veronica. Everyone's name's Veronica. Even the men. Even the men are Veronica. So close. And you're not even gonna hit me with the, the poison. Come on, man. Wow, that did nothing but paralyze. Uh. Of course, you're gonna use Super Potion. Well, I'm gonna use Twin Needle again. So take that. Okay, I think you have one more. I'm digging this experience. Lady on. Yeah, I'll switch out, because you're paralyzed. Oh, you do not have just two, you have five. your attack is going to miss. And it's not going to do very much. So since we're stuck in fly, let's go back. Uh, let's get Rain Fawn in the mix. Now that Endor has passed out Rain Fauna in levels. Uh, the other benefit Going back to Pokemon Tower, uh, the benefit in doing that as well is there are a lot of items as well as trainers in the Pokemon Tower, so we will benefit from both sides of that, both the items and I think there are TMs. Uh, I feel like there's at least one TM in there, so hopefully we can at least give Rain Fauna some variety in its stacks. He has a lot of five hit moves, which is all right because they're powerful, but it's also not the greatest because you only have five. Five attempts to do what you need to do. Oops. <laughs> Whoops. That's not going to benefit us at all. Yeah, soothing 
aroma that's 50 times more powerful. Oh, okay, that was scary. That was frightening. So let's not use aromatherapy again. Let's let hairy arms. That was also probably dumb because hairy arm is water flying. But it only did 14 damage. So to say that I'm worried about the Cyndaquil would be a lie. Because I am not worried about the Cyndaquil. I'll leave Harry Arms out. Just because I don't have a reason. Do not have a reason. Rough skin. Zapdos. Let's go back to Endor. Voting Endor MVP as of the late few episodes. Why? Like I said, it's just, it either does really well or does not so well. Um. I feel like a bug type move isn't gonna bother us. Please what steel and rock. Yeah. Sing isn't gonna bother us either, because it's gonna miss. And we outspeed the Zapdos. So ta-da! We have one. Awesome, level 36. Nurse Veronica. Alright, let's zoom back to the Pokemon Sender. Sure would. <sighs> Trapped. trip back. Sorry, I was trying to see my phone. Okay, so maybe we won't do all the things that I said about doing today, but we will definitely beat Veronica. I think we can pull off beating Veronica, and we can pull off at least catching something in the Pokemon Tower. If I get that much done today, I will be extremely happy. Plus, he's poisoned, so I'm already happy. Going and missed. Oh, nice. Well, then we're just going to use Twin Eagle again. Uh. Man, that was... Probably should have gone for something else, but oh well. Let's go with Sacred Fire. And that's gonna miss. And that's gonna hit. And that's gonna start. Are you kidding me? No way! No way, no way, no way. Seriously? Man. Dan's gonna be pissed. Gosh. Seven levels difference in one hit? Mm. Oh, that made me so mad. Like, I contemplated briefly just like, oh, you know what? I'm just going to start this over again. No one's going to know. No one's going to care. But that's not what we're doing. Gonna hold true. That just really sucks. Really, really, really sucks. Oh, oh, he was, what, 22 when we caught him? And he was 36 there. 14 levels of training. And of just using him, essentially. For one hit. Oh my gosh. That's so frustrating. 
We were doing so well, and I even texted Dan today that we're doing so well. I was like, yeah, we're on such a good winning streak with not losing anybody, and then, you know what? That's, that's it. I can't even be cocky. Like, it's not even the famous last word. I didn't say, I didn't say, like, I didn't say, sorry, I'm trying to read and talk. I didn't say, oh, no, he'll be fine with this, or, oh, this isn't gonna kill us in one hit. Did I? No, I didn't say that. No, I did not. But I did text Dan today saying, we've been on a really good streak with this. I don't want lock on. I don't want it. Not even gonna look. Don't want lock on. Ball toy. Leave your hairy arms in because I'm paranoid. Ah, man, that bums me out so much. So, so much. I can't believe that happened. I would say that's comparable to our Jelly Bob loss. Yeah, that's definitely up there, if not tied. <sighs> okay. Well, there's... There is our V of Erica. I should have let Dan take on Erica instead. Should have, should have just listened, but I didn't. And we get Constrict, which is useless to us right now. So now, I need to go back, and I need to deposit uh, Endor. If I can get it into the Pokemon Sender. God, it sucks so much. The rest of this video is just going to be me complaining about losing Endor. Let's take that lucky egg. We have lost so many. No, we can't take item like that. Uh, yes. Okay. So let's... No, I don't wanna. Let's go to Lavender Town. Man, it would've been quicker going the other way. Through the tunnel thing. At this rate. Okay, Lavender Town. Pokemon Tower. Let's make sure that we have Pokeballs. We have 20 Great Balls. That should be fine. He said, not knowing that it wasn't gonna be fine. Let's talk to all the sad people. And maybe this wasn't a really good idea. We had to put my dog down this week. Man, all the feels coming up now. Ugh. Okay. So, we should be able to get an encounter here. No, but we have Gary. So let's not let X Cloud lead. Let's lead with Rain Fauna. Um, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so let's hope this goes better. I don't know why I was skipping through that. I like to check the time. Oh, okay. So this is the last thing we're doing. I should have checked the time before. Come on. Okay, so let's... Uh, da, 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 that did 50 damage. Let's switch to... I sh I, it was extreme speed. I said I should have paid attention to the attack. Okay, it's one down. Rain Fauna, we have 34. Puchiana, I don't know what we know of Puchiana. Oh, yeah, yeah, I. Okay, well, we know that Puchiana is weak to, to water. 
Aerodactyl. Let's go to... Let's go to Mouthhead. Because we can at least fly and see what moves he has. I'm fairly confident we can outspeed most with Mouthhead. Or we have been. Um, I don't want to risk a, a lower defense, so I will switch back to Harry Arms. Glad I did. Go to the Crab Hammer. Cool. I don't remember anything about his starter. Oh, Parasect is his starter. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Paris was his starter, I believe. But I don't remember what stats he had. But it does not matter because Crab Hammer works. Blastoise. Nope. I'm just gonna stick with Harry Arms. I'm too paranoid. Like, once you lose one person in an episode, or one Pokemon in an episode, it's just. I don't know. You just. I'm like tense. I'm freaking out. I'm all paranoid. Yeah, okay. So, that'll put us at. Uh, 21 minutes. Cool. You stinker. Yeah, I know. How's your Pokedex going? I caught Cubone. Cool. Smell you later. Cool. So that's going to conclude part two on my last day of being 22. Sorry it ended tragically. Very, very, very tragically. So passing off to Dan and best of luck.